The Warren Opera House is located in historic Friend, Nebraska. Established in 1871, Friend became one of the most successful and rapidly growing towns in the state. This reputation, no doubt, attracted a wealthy Canadian grain merchant by the name of Joshua Warren to the area. Everyone who knew Warren described him as a highly motivated businessman who was years ahead of his time. He had the goal to construct a building that could not only hold what we know today as a mall, but also an elegant opera house. After several years of work and upwards of $40,000, his dream was realized when construction was completed on the Warren Building in 1889. This was the only building of its kind in the area and attracted people from all around looking for shopping and entertainment. In 1893, Joshua Warren passed away at the age of 50, but his legacy was not forgotten. The Warren Opera House continued to thrive, housing hundreds of different plays, musical numbers, and even circuses. However, 1917 marked the end of the Opera House era in Nebraska. The number of silent movie theaters and automobile owners grew, and the number of traveling shows dwindled, causing the Warren Opera House to be used less and less, and eventually fall into disrepair. Fast forward almost 100 years and enter the Friend Historical Society. Created in 2005, this group of highly dedicated men and women came together with the goal in mind of restoring the Warren Building. Early founders and visionaries of the Friend Historical Society added the Warren Opera House to the National Historical Register, and the Historical Society has spent countless hours renovating and repairing the structure. However, major funding is needed before they can fix the current state of the Warren Opera House and return it to its former glory. The iconic Warren Opera House, located on the second floor of the building, is truly what this structure is known for. But thanks to the efforts of the Friend Historical Society, the first floor of the Warren Building has been completely renovated and offers four more venues for the Friend community. The Mary Mary Quite Contrary Room, the Welcome Center, the San Carlo Room, and the Poor House. The Mary Mary Quite Contrary Room also referred to as the gallery, accommodates 30 to 40 people comfortably. The private bar and fireplace make it a favorite for reunions, business meetings, and holiday parties. The Welcome Center is the starting point for every tour of the Warren Building. With its collection of historic friend photographs and antiques, it truly gives visitors a sense of what the time period was like. The San Carlo Room is the Warren Building's largest gathering room. Capable of comfortably seating 200 people, it has hosted several wedding receptions, large parties, regional meetings, and local entertainers. And finally, the Poor House. Famous for its pizza, this bistro can serve anything from light snacks to specialty dinners to accommodate your dining needs. The Poor House features several of Nebraska's fine wines and liquors, as well as fountain drinks. It offers ample space for a night out with friends or with the family. In addition to these rooms, there is the Yokel Courtyard, located directly behind the Warren Building. This scenic spot, filled with beautiful flowers and paintings, was built in honor of the Yokel family, who generously donated the Warren Building to the Friend Historical Society. Since the arrival of the Friend Historical Society, the Warren Building has seen a resurgence in activity. Ironically, the Warren Opera House recently had its first opera, The Marriage of Figaro, performed by the UNL Opera Program. In 
In recent years, the Opera House has also been the site of paranormal investigations, as many claim that a ghost haunts the Warren Opera House. Entertainment is never in short supply either. The Friend Historical Society has hosted many fundraising events in the San Carlo Room as well to raise money for the Warren Opera House and to earn funds for other causes. The Warren Opera House truly is a place from the past where memories are made. To learn more about the Opera House or to schedule a tour or event, go to the Friend Historical Society's website, friendhistoricalsociety.org. I'll be seeing you on 2nd Street, where friends meet.